Brother Gibson. Yes, sir. Your fellow Buckeye. Ah, Corey, how'd you know? Um, uh, so, yes. Are you going to apply for the job, really? AD at Ohio State? No, not yet. Not yet. Uh, it's the usual suspects. Um, first of all, kudos to Gene Smith. Um, the culture that he's built here in the last 18, well, it'll be 19 years. Uh, when he leaves next year is 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 par excellent. So so shout out and kudos to, to Gene Smith and his program. Um, who's the next AD? Um, if you're asking me, it's going to be Martin Germain, the current AD at UCLA. Okay. Uh, you have a number of uh, protégés of, of Gene Smith, uh, Martin being one of them, uh, Heather Like at uh, Pitt, um, Diana Sabu, who's the uh, new athletic director at Utah State. Mm -hmm. uh, and, and like, as in last week. <laughs> yeah, yeah. as in last week. Uh, how about timing for that, right? Because um, she's definitely in the mix, but, with you know, that is, that's – I mean, um, Pat Chun, Pat Chun at Washington State is a, a gene protege as well. Um, but of those names, those are just in-house. Uh, ben J as well. But out of those, I think it's going to be Martin Jarman. Martin, he worked, was he work? did he work at Ohio State? Yeah, he worked at, yeah. he was a uh, gene's right hand man for seven years. Uh, Pat, all of those names I named worked at Ohio State under okay. Gene Smith. So, it's all in the family at this point. So, Andy, you know, you just got to keep grinding, man, if you want to become an AD at Ohio State. Just at some point <laughs> in the future, put that on your list to become AD at Ohio State. Or you just wait around and become the VP of athletics here at Houston, you know, in, what, 10, 15 years. That would be one of your goals, Andy, to become a, a VP of athletics for a Power 5 program? No. <laughs> no, Chris. <laughs> no, Chris. <laughs> 